Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another vlog. I'm actually not entirely sure if this is going to be like a moving vlog or if it's just going to be just my week. If you guys watched my last vlog, bless you doll, you would know that I moved. So I'm in a new place now in the same building but just in a different apartment. I really just spent the last week like sorting out this place. I still have so much stuff to get rid of, but I also have a lot of work that I need to get done this week before I go to Sydney next week for a week. This morning, I'm just heading to a hair appointment. GHD have very kindly organized for me to get my hair done to celebrate, I think it's like 19 years or something of their pink collection. So I'm gonna go head over to, I think it's Sketch Hair in Southport to go get my hair washed now. I think I'm just gonna do like a basic blow dry to be honest. I actually really need my hair done. It was my birthday last week. So I had a lot on, I was moving. So I definitely need to give her a wash. I actually think I washed it on Friday. It's only been like a few days, but you know, it'll still be nice to have it all nice and fresh. My place hasn't really changed much from the end of last video. I still have all of this stuff to get rid of, which Maya will actually be coming and grabbing all of this stuff today so she's gonna be taking that 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 all of this and that bag of depop stuff needs to go as well i do have a bit of work that i need to get done i need to try on all these pieces for my princess poly haul get that edited and uploaded i actually need to bring some lip products with me now what i'm gonna bring probably this this. this is the outfit of the day. This cardigan that I'm wearing is from Opoly. It's quite old, so I don't know if they still sell it, but my jumpsuit underneath is from Naked Wardrobe. Shoes, I'm just wearing these Air Forces. I put a little bit of makeup on just so I look a little bit more alive, but I feel like it doesn't even look like I have that much on. I call you pretty, but it never goes as planned. You think it's funny, I'm just trying to be a man. I want to show you in the best way that I can That I'm so in love with you Try to be serious but you can have it too It isn't easy to confess how hard I felt When we've just been friends since the day we met I don't know what to do Cause how can I try to cross all the lines That we've always had between you and I the suit if I'm just a friend to you How can I make you change your mind to see me different? Wish I could get your eyes on my prescription Cause baby all it takes is the same vision For me to get your heartbeat going down. How cute, Maya just came over with these gorgeous flowers for me I've literally got like a mini forest going on in my house right now. How nice are these? They're so pretty. And also this is the best part, this card. It says, happy birthday to the life of the party as long as that party ends by 9 p.m. That's literally me. She's so freaking cute, guys. Love her. She said she doesn't watch my vlogs anymore because she hates like seeing herself in it, in my videos. But if you do happen to be watching this one, thanks doll. Uh, but yeah, she just came and took away all that stuff that needed to be taken care of. This bag is still here, it's quite heavy. This is all stuff that needs to be donated, but I think I might give all this stuff to my mom. I mean, she can send back whatever she doesn't want to the Philippines. I mean, it looks a little bit less cluttered in this area, but this this is still a problem. James is gonna take my computer at some point this week, and then Sophia's gonna take the desk and also the drawers. I'm on my way to Remy's house now. I'm gonna go play with P for a little bit which I won't vlog because um, her parents don't like the kids on social media. She actually messaged me saying that my gift from James's parents had arrived. I'm not actually meant to know what it is, but she told me. Um, so they got me a pair of Hermes slides. They didn't have the exact color I wanted in my size. Um, so she said that if I want to just exchange it, I can. They're actually over in Europe at the moment, so that's why they got it delivered to Remy's house, which if you guys don't know, Remy is James's sister-in-law, so his brother's wife and Paris and Jax are their kids. People always ask, they're like, is that James's kid? Like whenever I talk about Paris or if I like post, I know it's not his kid, it's his niece and nephew. But yeah, I feel like people always get confused when I post them on 
like talk about them, which I have mentioned it a few times. So obviously not everyone watches every single thing. Rem's just made some delicious pasta. I just have a bowl. Now I'm just going to clean dishes for her while she puts Jacks to sleep. So I'm gonna get into that. Here they are. It also came with this little Hermes magazine, which is cute. And then the shoes. Hang on, let me just unbox this. This is them here. They're such a gorgeous color. You know, now I'm like, do I want these or do I want the mint green ones? Hi, can I just get a medium birthday cake latte? Sorry, I'll just double check if we still have it. We don't actually have the um, latte, the birthday latte. Though. Sorry. Oh no! All right, that's all good. That's all right. Thank you. I'll just go through. I'll try to reverse that. Thank you. I've been seeing all these Marcus ads about the birthday cake lattes and they don't even have it there. That's right, that was a fail. I'm just gonna make myself a coffee when I get home. I'm not about to pay $5 for a coffee. Oh, <laughs> that just tastes the exact same as the ones that I have at home because I get like the little sachets and I feel like they honestly, I mean, they don't really taste the same. Also, uh, my property manager did like a look around of the place and she's just gonna take me through and show me like all the problems with the property. She said one of the things is that the benches are badly etched, which I feel like my benches are fine. I think there's like a couple little stains on the bench, but like I've lived there for two years, you know what I mean? I feel like it's just general kind of wear and tear. So I'm going to have a look at what she says. If they're just being like anal about stuff that doesn't even make sense, then I'll like speak to the RTA about it and see what I can do because yeah, someone else in the building that recently moved out literally said he's like, I like scratch. He said that he scratched the tab in his place, like the tiniest bit and they made him go and replace the whole entire tap just from like a tiny little scratch. I don't know, I feel like when you're living somewhere for so long, like there's bound to be little things like that that happen. Perhaps at our place, they're like matte black, so you can just see like any little scratch. So like, I feel like that's something that can potentially happen. So I feel bad for that guy, but like, no, like you can't expect, if you're living somewhere for like two years, three years plus, like you can't expect it to look absolutely perfect. Look like what it was when it was brand new, you know what I mean? I don't know, maybe I'm wrong, but I've li I've lived out of home since I was like 18 and I've lived in like maybe four places now and I've never had an issue with anything. And she's come back with like so much stuff. But I can't escape it now. I hate myself. I hate my thoughts. We're thinking about you, and I'm thinking a lot. Cause I'm never around you. I will tell you, but I don't know how to say what I'm feeling. Now I've been feeling down. Cause I feel the distance growing. Spending more days without you. Don't like where we are going. Is it so weird to think that we could be more than friends? Am I just overthinking? Am I not? Morning, guys. It is Thursday today. I have a couple of things that I need to do today. I asked James to take the Jeep to work today because I need a bigger car because I want to go to Ikea and I also want to sort out my storage shed and get everything out of there because I literally realized I pay like $300 a month for storage and I actually don't really need anything in there. Like I don't really have much in there. It was mostly just for like my Christmas tree and a couple other random things. But I'm like, bro, $300 a month a year, that's like almost four grand. I may as well just buy a new Christmas tree every year and donate my old one or something. But I'm just gonna keep my Christmas tree at his house because it's only like four boxes. But honestly, I just never thought of doing that for some reason. I think because I haven't been there in so long and then I went the other week and I was like, why do I even have this? And then I also wanna go to Ikea for some like kitchen storage kind of things and yeah i'll buy all that today and then do my kitchen tomorrow and show you guys that the worst stomach cramps this morning they just came out of nowhere i'm not due for my period or anything so 
I'm not really too sure what's happening, but I am in so much pain. Like, my period cramps aren't even this painful, so I don't know what it is. It's, like, all over my stomach, just, like, the sharpest pain. I was thinking maybe it was because I was cold just before, so I put a nice thick jacket on. And I feel like it's already starting to go away, but I also took a Panadol, so I'm not sure if it was that. I have a little bit of a road trip ahead of us. I got this massive bag from Big W the other day, so I'm going to take that to Ikea with me. Okay, guys, there's a little bit more than what I thought. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just empty out the Christmas stuff, and then Maya can just give all this stuff, like donate all of this other stuff. I literally have the worst cramps today. I just, I can't. It's not going to happen for me today, doll. I don't even know what clothes and shoes I've got in here. Let's have a look. Let's still got tags on them. See, I just I don't really need that, do I? Like, why have I kept all this stuff? Uh, let's see. Shoes are in here. These are actually cute. These are cute too. Yeah, I feel like all this stuff can just be donated. I'm in the car. I just went to my shed, as you guys saw. I actually really like having a bigger car. I just feel like I can see everything. This car literally fits so much stuff, um, but my summer cramps are so bad that I just can't... Couldn't think of anything worse than doing like two trips to Salvo's right now, so I'm going to do that tomorrow. Put in all my Christmas tree stuff that I'm going to leave at his house, in his garage, and then I'm gonna go to Ikea. I need to get some food. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe I'm hungry. Getting out of here. So big of all your clothes. Is my camera gonna like Oh, yes it is. Oh! Cause maybe I could change your mind to see me different And I could get your eyes on my prescription And maybe all it takes is the same vision For me to get your heartbeat going Just as fast as mine And then I could be your guy That was such a fail I'll elaborate in a second. All right, that was literally such a fail. I don't know why, but I had it in my head that IKEA has like heaps of pantry organization like containers. I'll show you guys what I got anyway. I did see like storage containers that I liked at Kmart, but the thing that I find with Kmart's stuff is like it looks nice, but it actually doesn't like keep your food very airtight at all. And after like six months, it's just not that good. So. I got two of these to organize my undies and my socks in my drawer. I also got a new dish drying mat. This one's black. I also got just two sandwich bag things. I thought it was also time to upgrade my wooden spoon because the ones I have at home right now have been absolutely through it. I also got these for the marble if I want to put like any pots or pans or anything on the marble because I don't want to damage that. And lastly, I've got a scraper tool thing. One of these for one. It was like four dollars. So yeah, that's that's literally everything that I got. Could have just all been purchased from Kmart, but it's fine. It is what it is. Need to get your heartbeat going just as fast as mine. That I could be your guy, you know I keep you by my side. But maybe I'm just blind, or maybe I'm too serious. Da -da 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 -da.
Hey guys, I'm back home now. I did pop into Kitchen Warehouse on the way home, like I said, and I had a look at their containers. I was tossing up for a while on which ones I actually wanted to get. There was these glass ones with bamboo lids, and then I was like, I feel like I'm gonna drop those. So I ended up getting these ones. They actually have like three different collections, and these are the more expensive ones, but I feel like they're just the ones that'll work for me. I only got, I think I, I ended up spending like $120 and I think I only got like five containers. But these are actually really good quality and I'll kind of just get more as I go. I can't, like I couldn't really remember what I needed. So I got two of these like big pasta ones. Then I also got two of these, which I'm going to put like my, 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 I'm going to put my basmati rice in one and tuna in the other and then lastly i also got this one here which is for flour so yeah i got five and it cost me 120 dollars. so yeah i also popped in a kmart and i got two more of these linen look um storage boxes for my closet uh because i need two more so i got those i also just picked up this chopping board i actually want to change all my chopping boards into like these wooden ones because i just prefer chopping wooden chopping boards and then i also just got this clear short container with lid and i want to put like my teas and my instant coffees in here this is completely not home related but i also went to uniqlo and i got the comfiest jogger set ever like a zip up hoodie set so these are the pants and inside it's lined with like this really soft like sheepskin kind of like material um and i think it was like 80 dollars for the set and the jumper is so comfy as well i actually don't have any like zip up chucky sets all of mine are like just hoodies or sweaters so i'm really really happy with that This is not the vibes. It's not the vibes at all. It is Friday today. Um, I just did a little bit of cleaning around the house this morning, did a little bit of work, and now I'm just heading to lunch with Sophia. We're heading to La Luna, which is like a beach club here on the Gold Coast. The weather is incredible today. There's literally not one cloud in the sky, so it's the perfect day for it. What am I saying? I feel like this vlog is like a mix of moving stuff and just normal life. To be honest, I actually got a lot done in that first moving vlog, which I am really happy about because I haven't had to do like stress about moving as much this week. But I did see H&M has um, really nice new uh tableware like plates and stuff so i think i might pop in there at some point tomorrow and go have a look and i'll show you guys i saw these really really nice plates online i'm just not sure if they're gonna match my plates because they're like white with gold on the outside if they were white with silver i'd literally buy them in a heartbeat but all of my home decor is like silver so i just don't know if it'll go but i'm like does it really matter like it's just plates and stuff so like it's out 24 7 they are literally so nice though they're a little bit pricey but i reckon it's worth it because they look incredible so yeah i want to go have a look at them in person i know everything's been like gold this gold that the past couple of years with like home decor but i just find that gold can be a little bit tacky sometimes and it's also really hard because a lot of things are like have silver even though I love gold so much, like for example, this chair that I'm sitting on, the legs are like silver and it just look weird gold. So it's just one of those things. I guess you can get like everything all white in your house if you're going to do gold accents though. That's my current dilemma, but I do definitely want to get new plates and also new um, 
like glasses and stuff because I've had my stuff now for a really long time and to be honest I don't really love it like I don't know but to be honest when I got them I just like didn't really care what I had I just wanted anything I have to be ready in like 30 which I basically already am ready but I wanted to curl my hair um so we'll see how that goes I need to film another makeup tutorial soon. There's so many videos that I like want to film and then I just forget about it. I feel like my videos are like constantly vlogs all the time, but I feel like also that's everyone's favorite videos to see from me. But I've always wanted to do like morning routines, like, you know, makeup tutorials, get ready with me's. But then also I feel like that stuff kind of like goes onto my TikTok and then I do like longer videos on here. But I definitely want to be like, a lot more active across all social media platforms anyway my makeup's basically done i just need to do gloss um but yeah we're gonna do my hair i really just want to do like big loose really brushed out curls so it shouldn't take me too long it actually doesn't take me long at all to do curls in general so yeah i'm all ready to go this is my outfit this dress that i'm wearing is from that's so fetch coat is naked an AKD shoes and their slides and then I'm just wearing this little bag right here. Craig, can you say hi? <laughs> we are at La Luna. <laughs> Bye. Look at the day on it. I'm actually hot guys. I just have to take my curl off. Yeah. <laughs> what do you feel like? Yeah. We got our bug rolls. They look so yummy. These are my favorite bug rolls. They're actually. Kind of big, hey? Yeah, I don't know if I prefer these or the rickshaw ones. They're very True. different. I love the sweet chili though on this. It's freezing cold because we've literally just spent like 20 minutes taking photos. She had to oh, make it work. The lighting is not yeah. working today, guys. Yeah. It's a little bit later in the afternoon now. We got back from lunch. Lunch was really good. I did just film a unboxing haul for White Fox. I went to the post office and picked up that package. So I got that done and I also picked up a couple other packages as well. So I may as well just show you guys and unbox it for you guys. I got a whole bunch of David Jones gift cards as gifts from people from my birthday. Got this dress from Sandro that I've been wanting for a while. It was also on sale as well. Down to 500. This is what it looks like close up, the material. I have tried this on before and I just love it. And the bottom has like fraying down here. I am definitely gonna take this with me on some trips I have coming up. Oh, you can put straps on as well. I probably wouldn't, I'd leave it strapless. But yeah, this dress is so gorgeous and then from csb i picked up a few new things from the new izzy collection i actually really wanted to get this color but i just wasn't sure if it would suit me i don't know i don't know if light blue is like my vibe i do like pastels at the moment but i don't know about light blue i just haven't worn anything like that shade of blue before so i just don't know got a whole bunch of like black pieces okay this looks tiny I'm going to go check what size my normal leggings are because I might have to return these. But yeah, I got the leggings in an extra small. And they're scrunch ones. I have the other ones, but they're non-scrunch. I don't know. Sometimes you just like having scrunch. And then I got this top right here. No, just a basic. I have so much black activewear. I'm obsessed with black activewear. I got this one in an extra small. That looks like it'll fit me perfectly. And then I lastly just got this sports bra right here. I sized it to a small in this one. I'm definitely glad that I did because it's very, very small. Like even that might even be like not fit my boobs, but we'll see how it looks. I can always wear it under stuff, but I don't know. This is what the crop looks like on. I do like it, but I feel like it's really, really small. Like, I don't know, maybe I might size up to a medium. I think that's just like how it's meant to look, but I almost feel like it's too small for my liking. Okay, this is what the dress looks like. You guys can kind of see like in the mirror more. It's definitely like a really nice, like kind of holiday dress. You can't really see the details from afar, but like in real life, it's really nice. I wear this like during the day 
a, like a beach club or something. Heading to dinner at like eight tonight and it's still a couple hours away and I'm already ready and stuff. So I'm just gonna do my pantry stuff now, I think. Let's do this. I wash these this morning so they're nice and dry now. Just gonna put in everything. And this one I'm gonna put in there. Okay, that was very loud. This one is a problem. Because it's sharp. There we go. Tunas. Kinda stinky. I'm kinda stink. Hi guys, it is Saturday today. I'm just on my way to Pack Fair. I got a message from Hermes saying that my shoes are ready to pick up. I don't know if it was this vlog or last vlog that I was showing you guys what James's parents got me for my birthday. She popped into the store the other day and they said that they could order it in from Sydney. So yeah, she said it's ready to be picked up. I'm also going to just, I don't know. I did want to go and maybe have a look at some new plates in Maya because they're having a huge sale at the moment. Also H&M have some nice ones as well. I think I was telling you guys yesterday. So yeah, I'm just going to pop into a couple places and how can I help you? Pretty much. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have noticed this but I'm a very very indecisive person and I just don't know which plates I want. I feel like I like them all like all the options but I also want to make sure that they look like nice for content and stuff. So there was these ones which I thought were really nice. They're just like a little bit more plain. They kind of have like a bit of like a cracked look to it though which I don't really love. There was these ones which were a little bit more like a whitey gray color and then there was these ones that I showed you guys that sort of looks like at the bottom which I think are cool but I don't know also the all black ones which I really really like these the only thing with these is like the all black ones is I feel like I'd have to get black cutlery and like my stuff just doesn't go. I feel like if I got that, then I'd want to get like black cutlery and stuff. But it does also match the kitchen because all the like fixtures in my kitchen is black. Get myself a plate. I'm just eating one of my chef good meals. These are actually a lifesaver. 
because I, even though I love, oh, I love to cook. I don't like making, I really don't know what I'm doing. So I don't want to like buy all this food and then I end up going for lunch a few times a week or, you know, whatever it is. But yeah, I'm just having some prawn curry. I'm gonna have a think about it overnight and then I've got to go back to pack fair tomorrow for my laser appointment. So whatever I decide on, I'll just get it tomorrow. I just filmed like a cute little unboxing for TikTok, but these are the shoes that I got here. And when I put them on in store, like with the pink ones a few weeks ago, I just thought that these stood out just a little bit more. I still really like the pink ones. I think if they're still around in the summertime I might get them because I do love pink. I think I'll just get a little bit more wear out of these and they are my first colored Orans. So I wanted something that would really like bring my tan out and stand out a little bit more. So I love these so much. I'm very grateful for my in-laws for getting these for me. I'm obsessed with them. This snack drawer is literally the most dangerous thing because I swear I've never snacked so much more in my life until I made the snack drawer. Hello, my darling. Hello, my darling girl. Hi, Bobby. Hi. Before I close out the vlog, I want to show you guys what plates I ended up going with. The ones from H&M, I feel like, have my heart, but they really just don't go with my place. I mean, I could have made it work at the end of the day, you know. It's not like they stay out. I ended up just picking up these plates right here from um, Maya. I really like how they're like a grayish kind of white. Like there's gray speckles in there. So these are the bowls. I got four of those. This is the name of them. Salt and Pepper Relic Bowl. Wait, I think this is a shade mist. And I also really like how on camera it kind of looks white. Like for when I'm doing um, content and stuff, you know. They're coming up just white on camera, but I promise they're not. I'm just going to close out the vlog here. Um, it's kind of been like a half moving vlog, half just week in the life vlog. But I really hope you guys have enjoyed watching and I'll see you on my next video. Bye.